Ten former NFL players are now accused of defrauding a health care benefit program aimed at helping players and their families once they retire. The alleged multi-million dollar scheme involved several players with Georgia and Metro Atlanta ties. 11 Alive's Jennifer Bellamy is breaking down the indictments for us tonight. Very interesting story here. Yes, yeah, certainly is, Jeff. Among the 10 players charged, former Pro Bowl running back Clinton Portes. The FBI claims he and nine others submitted false claims to the health program run by the league and cashed in on reimbursements for medical equipment that was never purchased. And all their claims totaled nearly $4 million. The equipment included hyperbaric oxygen chambers, chirotherapy devices, ultrasound equipment used to perform imaging on pregnant women, and even electromagnetic therapy devices used to treat horses. Numerous individuals, including the NFL players involved, submitted claims for durable medical equipment, including items for more than $50,000 on a single claim. However, no such equipment was provided. In many cases, the medical providers and doctors had never even treated the patients involved. Players who were living in Metro Atlanta and Georgia at the time of the indictment are Robert McCoon, Carlos Rogers, James Butler, who's in Georgia Tech's Hall of Fame, and Fred Bennett. There's also Edric Pruitt, who played for the Falcons in 2004. Now, McCoon and Rogers are accused of being among the ringleaders for this elaborate scheme. Charges against the 10 men include conspiracy, health care fraud, and wire fraud. You can read more about the allegations right now on 11alive.com. And tonight at 6, we'll break down how prosecutors say this all played out.